What's up y'all? It's Kevin with Double Trouble. Today we're going to show you how to pick a spot for your salt bed. Come on buddy. Come on buddy. When choosing a place to set up your salt lick, an important thing to look for is deer sign. When we head out to set up a new lick, we look for a well-used trail, preferably one that leads from a bedding area to a food source. We then pick a spot a few yards off the trail and clear any leaves on the ground in a 3 foot by 3 foot area. Once it is fairly clear, we'll put out whatever product we have picked, be it mineral block or a powder. We use salt licks on our properties for several reasons. The first is to keep tabs on our deer herd via trail cams, because unlike other baits, a salt lick can go for six months or more without needing to be freshened up, which means you can spend less time contaminating your hunting area. The second is because in Tennessee, it is legal to hunt near salt. Always make sure to check state and local wildlife laws before using any kind of bait or attractant. Do you have a favorite salt lick trick? Let us know in the comment section below, or on our Facebook page, Double Trouble Hunting. Thanks for watching. I'm a desperate